Whew, what a game, what a game. <laughs> What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Duga, coming at y'all with another episode of Drop a Dimes with Mr. Duga. <laughs> and today I'm going to talk about today's thrilling extra inning matchup as you had the Atlanta Braves beating the Philadelphia Phillies 10-8 <clears throat> in 10 innings. And now the NL East division clinching magic number is four. Um, before I get into this video, for everyone, if you want to highlight at me on my social media, DM me, reach out, tell me whatever you got to do. I'm going to have all that information down in the description box. Um, so come highlight at your boy, yo. Man, with a game. <laughs> the game. I tell you what, man. You know, the way things stand right now, unless the Phillies were to get knocked off in the, in the wild card round, we looking at another Braves, Phillies, NLDS, yo. Um, and especially after what happened last year, that's a scary matchup, yo. Um, especially if we drop one of the first two at home and having to go over there. It's scary, man. That team, you know, that's the third seed. <laughs> you know, and, and with the the way the division situation is, um, you know, the Dodgers would actually get like the Brewers or somebody like that. Um, and we would have to get the Phillies, man. The Phillies are, at least offensively, man, that's that's a potent team, yo, with some star power, just like we have. Um, you know, Braves get out to a 2 nothing lead early. They come back tied at 2. Uh, we get out to a 5-2 to two lead with Matt Olsen, um, you know, getting a big, uh, getting some RBIs. They cut it to five to four. Then Michael Harris and Ronald Acuna Jr., who ML MVP superstar of all superstardom, <laughs> you know, Ronald Acuna hits a, hits a solo shot, and we have eight to four. And then the two big guns, you know, like our big guns, Olsen and Acuna came through. They two biggest guns, man. Trey Turner hits a two-run homer in the bottom of the seventh to cut the lead to eight to six. And then, man, bottom of the night, our Glaciers got a, 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 a closing streak where he's closed so many games in a row. And the first pitch, man, Bryce Harper knocks that thing out the park. Citizen Banks Park go crazy, man. We tied up at eight, man. We going to extras. And it's like, boy, I tell you. But, hey, that's what you get when you get two teams like this. You get the superstars coming through in the clutches moments, man. And that was really fun to see. But to us, our credit, we didn't panic. We didn't, you know, get out of, out of character. Kevin Pillar gets the big base, uh, comes in, hits for Eddie Rosario, gets the big base hit, puts us up 9-8. and eight. And then Orlando Arcia, who's, who actually has been one of our clutches hitters this year, gets the big um, RBI single to give us a little insurance. And then um, Kirby Yates, man, shuts that thing down in the bottom of the tent, and we escape out of there with the 10 to 8 win in the first game of a doubleheader today. And like I said, man, that was one of the better games, more entertaining games, you know, I've seen us play all year. I, the other one I could think of on the top of my head was, you know, that 13 10 Ozzy Albies three run walk off against the Mets. Um, you know, and I can think about when we lost the, what, the 11-10 game to Cincinnati on a Friday when De La Cruz hit for the cycle. Um, you know, yeah, uh, really, really good, fun, entertaining game, man. If you're a baseball fan, you had a lot of blast watching. Uh, had a big blast watching this. But what's so good about this win, man, as far as clinching, and not only are we trying to keep the Dodgers, off of us in the NL and the Orioles off of us, you know, for a potential World Series home field. Our magic number now to clinch the NL East is four. And what's so significant about that is we could clinch this thing in Philly. <laughs> like, if we win game two tonight and then we beat them tomorrow, the Braves will be the NL East champs and celebrate in, uh, in, in Philadelphia, man. So that would be something exciting to see. But either way, we're closing, we're closing in on a six straight NL East division title. What an accomplishment, what a moment to be a Braves fan, man. But big time game today, man. That was a lot of fun. Shout out to Trey Turner and Bryce Harper 
for for coming through for their teams and not only Acuna and Olsen, but I mean everybody, Riley, Albies, I mean every, you name it, everybody come through. Um, but with that being said, that's all I got for y'all today. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Hit the like button for your boy. Give me a subscribe. I have Atlanta Braves, MLB, and content on my other teams throughout the year. Y'all have a blessed one. Go Braves.